Food is ready. Cooking stuff is ready. Clothes are ready. Electricals and tat is ready. A few Christmassy things for the grandson and the girls. I think it's time for a car camp. Actually, I'm debating whether the grandson will get Santa, because I quite like Santa myself. I'm going up to see the girlies and my grandson in West Sussex, but I thought, let's have a stop off on the way. So I've come a day early. I'm thinking about uh, doing a car camp somewhere around Havant. I've been on the um, park for night and there's a nice one next to a pub overlooking the sea or I might even go on to Hailing Island and see what's there. Ah, it looks as though it's here on the left. Let's see what this one looks like. And if not, we'll carry on and we'll go over the bridge onto the island. Oh, it looks pretty busy. I think they left me a space right at the end. What happens if I went just here, I wonder? That's not too bad, is it? Well, this doesn't look too bad. Tides out at the moment, but I'm sure that'll be in later. A little bit of noise coming off of that road, but I think that will quieten down later on. And it's right next to the pub. And if that wasn't good enough, I can go over to the Royal Oak just over there. Right, I'm starving, Marvin. Time for something to eat. Now, half of me wants to go in the pub and have something there, but no, I brought my food. So let's see what we've got tonight. Tonight on the menu, we have yakitori chicken. Whatever the hell yakitori chicken is, but oil the kettle and it's ready. We're going to have some peas and carrots to beef it out and then some nasty Asda cooked ham just to give a bit more flavour and then because we're on a health kick we're going to have lots and lots of fruit unless I go and get some chocolate. Hmm. Good morning, not a bad night, uh, a little bit chilly, went down to six degrees and I haven't quite got all the winter stuff out yet, but I slept okay. I think it's time to uh, get up, get some coffee, get moving and see what the day has to offer. Well, this isn't looking too shabby at all, is it? The sea's come in and gone out again during the night, but it's a beautiful morning. Breakfast this morning, time for a coffee and an oat burst. Haven't tried these before. Quick oats. I suppose it's like ready break of our youth. Let's give it a go. It's nice and warm, quick and easy. It's a 
tomorrow morning though, we're gonna go for a quick breakfast, I think. Ah, beautiful day. One last walk, then it's time to move on. What are you up to, buddy? <laughs> You've been fun. Wow, cool. You're kicking your legs as well. Oh, wow. Boing, boing, boing. Where are we and what are we going to be doing? We're pointing to Pumpkin Patch and we're going to be picking pumpkins. Picking pumpkins! Do you need a wheelbarrow for... <laughs> <laughs> right. What now? A normal one. Well, just one normal one. Yeah. Okay. Like maybe medium. It's so cute. Right? Where did you find this pumpkin? <laughs> Hello. <laughs> You're not going to really get it through that small hole. Well, that was a fun day picking pumpkins with the family. Park up tonight is at the Jack and Jill windmills overlooking Brighton. Good morning. Beautiful morning at the Jack and Jill windmills. Just done a time lapse, so hopefully you've seen that and it's come out okay. Just had a beautiful hour here. Uh, was talking to a lady who is South African and she's just about to have a trip there and I've traveled South Africa, so that was lovely. Then there were some charity runners that came along that are running for motor neurons disease and I took some photos for them for their charity and uh, it's funny because my father passed of motor neurons about 20 years ago so there's a lovely connection there and for the last 10 minutes I was talking to a chap who came up here um, he's just lost his wife and this was their favorite place so he comes up here to remember her and there's just been some lovely connections and talking to people but uh, it's time to go and see the girls again and get some breakfast. And I think we're gonna go out and hit some charity shops. Okay, just left the windmills and met Jess and Archie and we're doing some charity shops and then get some breakfast. That was another fantastic weekend away. So enjoyed being with Danielle, Jesse, and Archie. And the two car camps, uh, both off part for night, hadn't been to either of them. Really enjoyed them, absolutely perfect. If you don't use part for night, do go on and have a look. There is a free version you can use, or you can pay a tenner and it unlocks all the features. It will tell you where the spots are, the amenities, people will put reviews on, whether it's noisy and it's quiet, whatever. It is really worth a tenner a year. But that's the end of another lovely weekend. Until next time, see you soon. Ta-da.